I kind of decided on the last second I was going to film this. I actually, uh, I've made this before. This is kind of like my Mexican uh, lasagna. Let me show you what I do. Get one of these kits. Get you a bunch of cheese and, uh, and some salsa. What I did was I actually, for the bottom layer, I, uh, believe it or not, put a little cornflakes on the bottom. Kind of suck up the excess moisture, things like that. After I, uh, after I put that down, I put down some cheese. I put down um, a whole bottle of salsa, mild, and uh, I layered it with the soft taco uh, shells. This, this turns out absolutely wonderful every time, by the way. Now for the taco seasoning meat, you put that in with the, uh, the meat just like you're making a taco, but you're not. You're making taco flavored lasagna, which is a hundred zillion times better. Plus, you're not worrying about all of your guests making a mess out of your kitchen because you have basically the entire setup in one pan. Now, you don't have to do the mushrooms like I did. That's uh, just kind of my take on it. You can add uh, corn if you want to. Anything that will basically go with the taco, you can put in this pan and make a lasagna out of it. Total genius. Forgot to mention, I actually put uh, some chicken on the bottom layer. I usually put the meat on the top layer, but I decided to have two different kinds of meat in this one. There really is no wrong way to do this. That's why this recipe is kind of a mosh pit, man. Because do what you want. You just, you layer it, you throw it in the oven at about 300 degrees, 20 minutes, just long enough to melt the cheese, and boom, your meal is done. The beef has been applied. This is absolutely wonderful. Not only have I never gotten a complaint, but I've had people, friends actually tell me, when you make this, you need to give me a call so I can stop by. You know, of course I'm not going to do that because uh, <laughs> this is for me. I'm going to eat on this for, uh, oh, this is going to take me, I want to say, well, depending on how hungry I am, two, three days, maybe more. This is going to be breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm going to enjoy every bit of it. Like I said, uh, about 350 for, I don't know, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, well, about 300 for 20 or 30 minutes is a good way to do it. Absolutely wonderful. Well, if that was any prettier, it'd be a picture of me. <laughs> oh, the goodness in which I am about to partake. Mm, seriously. All right, folks, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. If you could leave a hot on the vibe, there was a favor, and now someone got a Kindle from. I'll see you on the flip side. Mm. Hello, thanks for watching. If you don't mind, if you could like and subscribe, that would be lovely. Thank you, and have a nice day.